Howda. A howda, or howda, derived from the Arabic, that means bed carried by a camel, also known as hatha howda, is a carriage which is positioned on the back of an elephant, or occasionally some other animal such as camels, used most often in the past to carry wealthy people or for use in hunting or warfare. It was also a symbol of wealth for the owner and as a result was decorated with expensive gemstones. Most notable are the golden howda, the one used in display at the Napier Museum at Thiruvananthapuram which was used by the Maharaja of Travancore and the one used traditionally during the elephant procession of the famous Mysore Dasara. The Marangarha Fort Museum in Jodhpur, Rajasthan has a gallery of royal howdas. In the present time, howdas are used mainly for tourist or commercial purposes in Southeast Asia and are the subject of controversy as animal rights groups and organizations such as Millennium Elephant Foundation, openly criticize the use of the howdah, citing information that howdahs can cause permanent damage to an elephant's spine, lungs, and other organs and can significantly shorten the animal's life. The Marangarha Fort Museum, Jodhpur, has a gallery dedicated to an array of hatha howdah, used by the Maharaja of Mewar, mostly for ceremonial occasions. Hatha howdah, Marangarha Fort Museum Silver Hatha Howda, Marangarha Fort Museum Hatha Howda or Elephant Seat in the Marangarha Fort Museum Howda of the Qutb Shahi Dynasty Howda were used extensively during the Carnatic Wars. Howdas with battlements inspired elephant and castle imagery. The American author Herman Melville in Chapter 42 of Moby Dick, writes to the native Indian of Peru, the continual sight of the snow howda head Andes conveys not of dread, except, perhaps, in the more fancy of the eternal frosted desolateness reigning at such vast altitudes, and the natural conceit of what a fearfulness it would be to lose oneself in such inhuman solitudes. It also appears in Chapter 11 of Jules Verne's classic adventure novel Around the World in 80 Days, in which we are told the Parsi, who was an accomplished elephant driver, covered his back with a sort of saddle cloth, and attached to each of his flanks some curiously uncomfortable howdahs. Tolkien also wrote in Lord of the Rings of the Mamakil of Herod with howdahs on their backs. A derived symbol used in Europe is the elephant and castle, an elephant carrying a castle on its back, being used especially to symbolize strength. The symbol was used in Europe in classical antiquity and more recently has been used in England since the 13th century, and in Denmark since at least the 17th century. In antiquity, the Romans made use of war elephants, and turreted elephants feature on the coinage of Juba II of Numidia, in the 1st century BC. Elephants were used in the Roman campaigns against the Celt Iberians in Hispania, against the Gauls, and against the Britons. The ancient historian Polyanus writing, Caesar had one large elephant, which was equipped with armor and carried archers and slingers in its tower. When this unknown creature entered the river, the Britons and their horses fled and the Roman army crossed over. However, he may have confused this incident with the use of a similar war elephant in Claudius' final conquest of Britain. Alternatively, modern uses may derive from later contacts with howdahs. Fanciful images of war elephants with elaborate castles on their back date to 12th century Spain, as at right. Notably, 13th century English use may come from the elephant given by Louis IX of France to Henry III of England for his menagerie in the Tower of London in 1225, this being the first elephant in England since Claudius. Today the symbol is most known from the elephant and castle intersection in South London, which derives its name from a pub, using the old site of a Cutler's, who had used the symbol of the worshipful company of Cutler's. The Cutler's, in turn, used the symbol due to the use of ivory in handles. The elephant and castle symbol has also been used since the 13th century in the coat of arms of the city of Coventry, and was used in the 17th century by the English slaving monopoly, the Royal African Company, which led to its use on the guinea coin. The symbol of an elephant and castle is also used in the Order of the Elephant, the highest order in Denmark, since 1693.